A surgical bed is intended to facilitate transfer of a patient from a stretcher to the bed after a procedure. You'll make the bed when it's unoccupied, but remember to perform hand hygiene first. Verify that the bed is in the locked position and at a comfortable working height. Lower the side rails on the side you will work on first. Put on a pair of gloves and remove the soiled linen. Place the soiled linen in a linen bag, taking care not to let it touch your uniform. Avoid shaking or fanning the linen. If the mattress is soiled, clean it with antiseptic solution according to your agency's housekeeping policy. Dry the mattress thoroughly. Then remove your gloves and perform hand hygiene. To make a surgical bed, the linen is used in the same order as when making an unoccupied bed. See the video for making an unoccupied bed. Lay the top sheet on the bed with the vertical center fold placed lengthwise down the middle of the bed. Open the sheet out from head to foot, keeping the top edge of the sheet even with the top edge of the mattress. You can also spread a blanket or bedspread evenly over the bed in the same fashion. Make a cuff by turning down the edge of the top sheet. Fold all the excess linen from the foot of the bed toward the center of the mattress so that the linen is even with the foot of the mattress. Then fold the corners toward the opposite side of the bed to form a triangle. Then fold the hanging portion up. Move to the other side and finish making the bed. Stand on the side of the bed opposite that on which the patient will be transferred and fan fold the linen toward you. Apply a clean pillowcase and lay the pillow at the head of the bed. See steps for applying a pillowcase in the video for making an unoccupied bed. Be sure to leave the side rails down and place the bed in the high position to match the height of the stretcher. Then perform hand hygiene. One, two, three. One, two, three. Perfect. You doing okay? Mm-hmm. All right.